fear the government there's tyranny when the government fear the people there's liberty ever hear that one that's Thomas Jefferson let's look at what is tyranny all right tyranny is the cruel use of power cruel and unjust exercise of power or authority over others oppression oppressive government by one or more people who exercise absolute power what is liberty liberty is the right to choose the freedom to think or act without being constrained by necessity or force Freedom. Freedom from captivity or slavery. Basic right. Political, social, economic right that belongs to the citizens of a state or to all people. Today, unfortunately, we have a tyrannical government with very little liberty left. See, the government is supposed to work for we the people. We elect our representatives to represent us. But there's a problem with that. There's things like a faulty voting system. Uh, things like money. Money can be a huge tool for political persuasion. Being lazy and not taking responsibility for uh, being a citizen of this great country. Uh, when people don't even know the branches of the government, how do we expect to govern the government? Now, when people aren't governing the government, it turns into this overreaching, intrusive, power-hungry, ridiculously corrupt monstrosity that it is today. If regular Mr. and Mrs. American don't control the money, can't vote in an honest system, and aren't being feared by the government, what can we do? We speak out. By speaking out, we attempt to wake up as many people as we can until it is no longer possible to ignore us. We peacefully take back America by being informed and involved with determining the direction of this country. We have to exercise our rights to keep them alive, as a reminder that, that there are still liberty-loving patriots left in this country. Now, I'm not perfect, and I'll never claim to be. What's important is that we support all the patriots in this fight, and work together to educate as many people as we can before there's nothing left. With that said, I'd like to thank a few channels for doing exactly that, and giving me the courage and motivation to create this channel and throw my hat in the ring. Main Prepper. Out of all the YouTube channels I watch, I have learned the most from him. I admire him greatly and I feel truly honored to be able to, to learn uh, from a man with so much knowledge and wisdom. I would also like to thank him for the, his dedication to this country and the great people in it. Such. I've probably been watching Such for five years now. Outstanding videos. Uh, very informative and, and entertaining. As an avid Second Amendment supporter and a fellow shooter, it's nice to get information on different firearms that I haven't personally had experience with uh, for familiarity and consideration. His Sensible Survival channel is outstanding as well. Nothing fancy. I mean, what can I say about nothing? Uh, I don't buy a piece of gear without going to TNP and checking out a video over it. Um, very thorough and professional. Uh, and his work is greatly appreciated. Uh, he gives great direction on his call to action videos and his political videos as well. Uh, Demcad, I think he's extremely intelligent and I've gained a lot of knowledge by watching his progressions with prepping, firearms, and news coverage. I really appreciate him putting himself out there and showing us uh, his experiences. The Haas UMC. <laughs> Probably the most creative and interesting videos I've seen. He definitely teaches us that things don't have to be exactly conventional to be effective. I agree with a lot of his political positions and I support his message of liberty. Uh, there are many, many more and I'm sure I left someone out I wanted to mention, but the point is these are the people that who have motivated me to create this channel and I thank you for your inspiration. I've been awake for like five years now and what I've learned from the great patriots of this country is that to just complain privately and bury your head in the sand 
uh, you're doing nothing but contributing to the problems that got us in this position today. Uh, I've decided to create this channel to speak out and to wake up as many people as I can and try to be part of the solution and not the problem. And I welcome you to do the same. I'll end this video with a quote. I am an American. I believe in the Constitution. I believe in the Declaration of Independence. And I believe in the principles upon which this country was founded. That's Gerald Salente on the Alex Jones Show, April 29, 2013. You decide the outcome. Don't be a patsy.